If you've ever noticed small, red, itchy bumps on your skin, particularly around your lower body and near your ankles, chances are you have flea bites. Fleas infestations can occur in a number of settings, but the most common one is a home with pets that roam outdoors from time to time like dogs or indoor-outdoor cats. If you have fleas, you'll want to do whatever is needed to get rid of them as soon as possible because the problem won't go away on its own. One method for treating particularly bad flea infestations is using flea bombs, which work by number pick a gun dev TTY USB 0. If you are details person like me, let's dive into the step-by-step -step process for flea bombing your house efficiently. How to flea bomb a house. Welcome to my channel. Here we talk about gardening tips and pest control methods like this. So you're here for the first time maybe it's a good idea. To subscribe. Also click the bell icon. So that you receive notifications on my new upload. Part 1. Preparing the house. 1. Calculate the area. Calculate the square footage of the area you will be treating. Flea bombs come in a variety of sizes depending on the brand and chemicals they contain. In general you will need one bomb per room you are treating. However in some cases, one bomb in a hallway adjacent to open doors can treat multiple rooms. Read the label carefully to determine the size of the area the product treats. 2. Purchase a quality brand. Ask your veterinarian for his or her advice on which products they recommend. Check with friends and family for their opinions on the effectiveness of a flea bomb they might have used, or check online for feedback and reviews. Ask sales associates at your local home improvement or hardware store for any information they may have concerning flea bombs, but always back up what you're told by a retailer with your own quality research. 3. Read the package instructions. Read the package instructions completely. Most flea bombs operate in similar ways. Ensure that you have read the directions carefully and fully prior to setting off the flea bomb in your home. 4. Plan a time for fogging. Plan a time where everyone in the household including pets will be gone for several hours. The chemicals in the flea bomb are poisons which can easily cause illness to people and pets. Check the label on your flea bomb to ensure that your family is safe and can stay out of the house for the label's recommended time period. 5. Open doors and drawers. Open all doors to infested rooms so the chemicals from the flea bomb can kill the fleas. Open cabinet doors and drawers to kill fleas inside furniture. 6. Remove eating utensils. Remove eating utensils, food, small appliances, and crockery. Remove such items from open cabinet doors or drawers to keep them away from the spray. Storing items away from the chemicals is much easier than cleaning them when the flea bomb is finished. 7. Cover all equipments. Cover your tabletops, countertops, special furniture and electronic equipment. The chemicals from the flea bomb can soil furniture, tables and countertops or damage electronic equipment. Cover these items with sheets or plastic tarps to prevent damage. Two old sheets can be found easily at your local thrift store. Plastic painting tarps are available from hardware and auto stores. 8. Seal up remove. Seal up remove your fish tank. Chemicals in a flea bomb are dangerous to fish. If you can't move your fish tank to another location, cover it up well and seal it tightly with plastic wrap. 9. Turn off all electrical devices. Turn off all lights and other electrical devices. The chemicals and propellants in a flea bomb can be flammable. Turn off the heater or air conditioner and extinguish the pilot light. Cut the power to all fans. 10. Close all windows. Close all windows prior to treatment. Make sure that the flea bomb chemicals do not leak outside the house and have maximum effectiveness by closing all openings to the outside prior to treatment. 2. Treating the house. 
1. Vacuum and clean. Vacuum and clean your house immediately prior to treatment. The vibrations from a vacuum cleaner cause flea larvae to emerge making your flea balm treatment as effective as possible. 2. Remove all dirty. Remove all dirty laundry from the house. Flea eggs and larvae may find shelter in piles of dirty clothes. Ensure that you have laundered all of your clothes or bag the clothes and take to a laundromat while you are bombing the house. 3. Position the flea bombs. Position the flea bombs on newspaper or plastic bags in the middle of the rooms you are treating. Placing a protective covering under the flea bomb will prevent the residues from the product from staining the floor directly around the flea bomb. 4. Flea bombs placement. Ensure all the flea bombs are in place prior to activating any of the bombs. Once a flea bomb is activated you should vacate the house immediately to prevent illness due to pesticide exposure. 5. Activate the flea bombs. Activate the flea bombs and vacate the house. Follow package directions to activate the flea bomb. If you are setting off multiple flea bombs, start in the room furthest from the exit and work your way out. Once a flea bomb has been activated, do not re-enter the room. 6. Stay out of the house. Avoid unnecessary exposure to the chemicals in a flea bomb by keeping all pets and people out of the house for 2 to 4 hours. Read the label carefully to determine the recommended time frame to be away from the house. 7. Treat your pet for fleas. While you are away from the home it is important to remove fleas from your pet so they do not bring them back into the home as soon as you return. Ask your veterinarian about pills containing the tempram to kill any adult fleas that are on your pet. Bathe your pet with a flea controlling shampoo. Take your pet to a groomer to get a professional flea treatment or dip. Part 3. Maintaining a flea-free household. 1. Clean your house. Clean your house when you return. Dead fleas, chemical residue and a coating of dust are common things to find after a flea bomb treatment. Vacuum and mop floors thoroughly, clean tables and countertops, wash sheets and clothes, and wash all surfaces. It's recommended that you wear gloves when cleaning and dispose of the gloves after cleaning to avoid picking up chemical traces on your skin. 2. Open windows. Open windows to ventilate the house and reduce odors. The smell of the pesticides may persist for several hours or days after treatment. Open doors and turn on any ceiling or ventilation fans to help remove the odors from the flea bomb from the house. 3. Vacuum daily. Vacuum daily for 10 to 14 days. Daily vacuuming will remove any newly hatched adult fleas that may have survived the flea bomb. 4. Be prepared. Be prepared for multiple treatments. Some products are not effective at killing flea eggs. Flea eggs and larvae may hatch days or weeks after your first treatment. Monitor your house and pets for several weeks following initial treatment to watch for signs of fleas. 5. Monitor your pets. Monitor your pet for signs of reinfestation. Flea dirt or droppings appear as reddish-brown specks on your pet. If your pet is scratching, use a flea comb to check under their fur for signs of flea dirt or adult fleas. Under their fur for signs of flea dirt or adult fleas. Thanks for watching. Subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update from Guardian's Choice Official.